Okay. Each salad plate was worth was was costed at four dollars each. So each meal was four dollars. And students who we thought maybe couldn't afford this were often recruited as volunteers before the issue even arose. And it was really done on a case by case basis. But we we would ask them to maybe help clean up or help to serve and um, we would kind of pay them in a free salad. What we try to do is make as little with as much dignity as possible and, and being very surreptitious about it. We do it on a case by case basis. So we might also catch a student doing something really nice or um, having some leadership opportunity uh, that we would see them doing in the schoolyard and we would just reward them saying, oh my gosh, you're going to get this kindness award. And the award is um, free salad, a free salad session for this term. So that just became one of our little awards we would give. And teachers were allowed to look for a couple of excuses to give these away. Usually, you know your students well enough to know this, this child's family might not be able to afford this. Um, we try to make it as inconspicuous as possible. Um, at the end of grade eight, we have a graduation at our school, we're a K-8 school. And uh, we have leadership, kindness, and citizenship awards. So our main core group of amazing students would come every day and know the routines and set up the school, the salad bar. They were often rewarded with the citizenship award. And as we give those awards, there would be a small speech that I would give explaining, you know, these are leaders and this is what they did. And what I found was the next year, students came to me asking if they'd be on the team uh, early on because they knew that their older peers had had been recognized for their leadership and for their citizenship. So that worked, worked quite well to help out. Um, there were times when the salad bar would run at a loss. Some weeks we would spend uh, a little bit more on food than the price would cover. But we find, so if we had cheese or a kind of meat or something that was a bit more expensive, we'd run at a loss that week. And then the next week it might be a cheaper one uh, that would make up for that cost. So in the end, it, the, the whole salad bar was quite profitable, uh, even enough to cover these losses and, and then some over the long run. Um, 